assalamu alaikum uh, today we will talk about the probability and uh, how we'll handle it and uh, how will we use and uh, solve these questions of the probability uh, i hope all the uh, persons and everyone will be all right uh, so let's start what is the probability uh, probability is the number of chances that a particular event would occur uh, our world is uncertain and uh, all the events occurring around us are uncertain we cannot say yes or no so we can uh, get the number of chances of an event occurring for example uh, rain is coming yes or no we cannot say yes or no but we can uh, say that the number of chances is 60% number of chances of happening a rain uh, is 70% 80% that is the probability so the probability is the number of chances a particular event the event is what is event event is uh, like just uh, rain happening is a event so the probability it is the number of chances an event uh, would occur let's start with another, another example for example if we roll or die and uh, we want to uh, check the number of chances of getting six uh, so the, the number of chances will be uh, one out of six events uh, six events can be occur but the number of chances for the sixth uh, dots is only one out of six take another example uh, for example we want to uh, check the number of chances of even dots in a rolling die so uh, there will be three outcomes for example two four and six so there will be three out of six chances uh, of gaining the two four and six and so the probability of this uh, event will be three out of six or we can say that three over six next is the sample space sample space uh, is a set we can say it a s uh, containing all the possible outcomes of an experiment for example we uh, take an experiment and number of outcomes if we gain a number of outcomes and put it into a set then we can say that it is a sample space and if the particular outcome particular outcome is called the event and all the outcomes is called the sample space for example uh, in a rolling die the sample space will be all the outcomes that is one two three four five and six and e events will be for example we want to odd dots so the event can be one three and five next is mutual mutually exclusive events mutually exclusive events are those events uh, which are the events of a sample space and they are disjoint sets for example here uh, sample space is 1 3 5 and 9 and an event a and b are there e a is the event that is containing 1 3 and 5 and b is uh, b containing the 9 both these sets are disjoints they do not have any common elements so they are disjoint sets and these two events are called mutually exclusive events of that sample space next uh, how we will find the probability uh, first uh, we have to uh, note that the probability of any occurring event will be maximum one and it will be at least or the minimum is uh, number is zero for example if there is no chance of occurring any event so the probability of that event will be zero and the probability of a certain chance for example if we, if we know that the probability or the number of chances is 100 percent so we can say that that is probability is one so the probability of any event between lie between zero to one here is the formula 
that is the probability of any event number of event over number of sample space uh, here is the number of events number of ways of occurring event for, for occurring that event over number of sample space we can get this in a suitable example for example find the probability that a slip of a number divisible by 3 are picked from the slips for example we have 10 slips and we want to uh, pick a slip but the prob we want to find the probability that the picked number or pick the slip is divisible by 3 so we know that there are 10 slips so the sample space will be 1 to 10 so the number of sample space will equal to 10 here event what is the event we want to find the slip number divisible by 3 that is the event so how many slips can be the divisible by 3 so there are three slips 3 6 and 9 so the number of event of ways number of ways event will be 3 so no, next we can find the probability probability that of that event number of e here over number of s so 3 over 10 we can uh, get it out with the next example for example we have a park and india playing a cricket match and we want to find the probability that a park does not lose so first we have to calculate the sample space that all the possible outcomes of that event uh, in a match there can be three possibilities number one uh, a match can be win a match can be lose and a match can be draw so then now the sample space for that event will be win lose or draw the number of sample space equal to three and the event we want to find that the pack does not lose so the uh, elements in that event will be win or draw uh, the number of event will be 2 and probability of that event will be 2 over 3 in that as we can uh, we have uh, just read the formula for that in the last example so uh, we will discuss in the practice questions here are the two practice questions you have to uh, you can uh, solve this or practice it that is number is a box containing slips and number 1 to 10 and we have to find the uh, we have to find the probability that the number on the slip is a prime number we have to pick a slip but the, we could we, we have to find the calculation of the probability that how many chances of getting a slip but the slip must be prime number and here is the next example uh, bag containing 20 balls out of three are yellow 11 are black and six are brown so the two practice question is the probability that find ball is not yellow and the probability that ball is yellow here are both uh, solutions you can uh, also see it but uh, i recommend yeah, that you should uh, write it on with your own self thank you so much for